Hey guys, I'm back with another video. I'm going to talk to you about this. So, it comes again with the All Ireland Real Local Passion. It's all about GA Sports. So, we have the shitty old life of the COVID life that people are living there. People are getting actually used to the COVID life there, to be fair. Because if they think about it, whoa, what? I have. A bit more money. I'm actually seeing my money. I'm actually seeing my wages there. A bit of it. How? Because you're not spending on pints at the weekends there. Down in a couple of barrels of beer there. That's true. Yeah, I can see my money. All right. Jeez. I am look for... I am fucking loaded there, Jesus. I'm going to be rich after this there. Can't go out to nightclubs there. Probably spend like 200 quid at a nightclub there. But anyways, now. Best thing ever. Right? Mayo versus Dublin. We all know we a couple of um, years back, about like two to three years ago, yeah, Dublin and Mayo, right, were in the All-Ireland final in County Dublin, Crow Park, Dublin, Ireland. Really? Mm-hmm. And what do you think about um, Dublin, Ireland, Keane? Dublin, Ireland is good, okay? But when it comes to Mayo versus Dublin, very, very tight game. Really? Yes, it is. We looked at Kerry and Dublin, right, in 2011, right? One, um, one person got a point there for Kerry. Dublin got another one there. Same goes again and again and again and again and again. One person gets a goal there. We get two goals there. We're up by two. There they get another three to four goals there. Kerry do. Then uh, Dublin then get another seven goals there. And then Kerry come back then with loads of free takings there. Probably like six to seven free takings there. Won the game there. Almost by, they lost by a point at the end. And then dubs are victory. Like that. And that's how they won it. In 2011. The Dubs did. Then. When, when it came to Donegal. Yeah. And Dublin. Yeah. They were battling. Absolute battling they were. Donegal caught the ball there. In the first half there. Of the start of the game. Solo down. Going nowhere. <sighs> no one's on my side there. No one's on my side. Sold the ball all the way there. No one cares about your social life. And then bang. Back of the net. There. Like that. Really? Yep. There. Puts Dublin on her spot. There. Then Dublin react. Then. Okay. We, we can't let that happen again. And then. Bam. What happened then? Donegal won the All-Ireland then. In 2012. I think it was. Anyway, now, Mayo, Mayo versus Dublin, O'Shea's got a couple of goals, a couple of scores there in the All-Ireland there before, versus Dublin, right, Dublin came back there, second half, there, very tight games they were, it's like the Kerry game, what I just said, there, you know what I mean, Cluxton takes out a good L3 from the 45 there. Over the bar it goes. He runs down there. Mayo gets a goal. There. From the O'Shea's. There, you know. I said, Jesus. Like, to be fair, right? Mayo have copped on a lot. They achieved a lot. There now. Really? Yep. They're playing against Dublin. It's like it's like Dublin playing in, 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 a, in an all Ireland final hurling. Versus Kilkenny. There. It's like that. It's like whoa. Dubs are back in. Into the centre again. Versus Kilkenny. Whoa. That's a tough game now. Come on the cats. Do you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. But. Back to. The Mayo versus Dublin final. For this year's 2020. It's going to be a very very hard game. Very competitive game. That's what everyone wants. Okay, you look at Leash versus Dublin there, right? That was played there a couple of weekends ago. Yeah. <coughs> <coughs> they absolutely hammered them. Dublin did. Took it off it by a mile. 
they did absolutely by a mile. Absolutely. It's like, whoa, well, did they even train? Did they even, like, you know, do any damage or hustling or anything there? Or tackles? No. Looks like they didn't. How, how, how did the, Dublin bet them by a mile? Basically. Jesus Christ. You look at um, Mead versus Dublin. There. How did Mead lose a pile of... Like, they're fit lads on that squad. As my teacher always says. Fit lads on that squad. The squad. Right? There's fit lads on that squad there. Built there. Properly can actually... Literally from the 45. Kick it out of their hands. Over the bar of goals. You've seen those amazing kicks. That they do there. When they don't get their own way. They lob it up. Over their heads. Over the bar. It goes there. And Hawkeye sees it. And it goes wide. It looks like it went over the bar. Yeah, it did. Because you're in Crow Park. Oh, yeah, that's true. You know. I think they're actually fit me. I mean, not me, I am. Me there. Versus Dublin. And then Dubs can actually find a way. Like, Dubs can actually, like, settle for a little bit there. For 10, 20 minutes then. And then they tune in. Right, lads, let's go. And then it's like once they're fully boosted up, power to go, ready to go. Like a healthy drill, basically. Drilling through balls. They are there. Back of the net there. They do the dubs do the the old thing with the ball. Parse the parcel, as I call it in games. Parse the parcel. They do. And then over the bar it goes. Cluxton comes out. Takes the free takings there. Over the bar it goes. No pressure, Cluxton. Really? Yep. And then that's how. They win the game. Dublin know exactly how to react. Certain times they may like fail a little bit, but not much, not much. And then after that, then they know exactly what to do in situations. I was like, okay, they got two goals now. They're ahead of us there. Right. Okay, guys, what? Half time now, right? We need to win this game, right? Let's get a victory there and wipe the smile off those fuckers' faces there. We, we want to be, before we retire from Dublin squad... We want to win every single single game like we have there, right? All of us, like Cluxton, as in me, I'm Cluxton, and won so many titles there of being captain or being on the squad for so many years. And I want you guys to exceed as well. So let's go out there and wipe those smiles off those mead fellas cunts. Right, let's go the fuck. And then off they go then, run onto the field again. And what happens then? Boom! They blast them out of the fucking game. They did there. And that's how it comes to Mayo for some balls on Dublin, the county board. So, the Mayo game. It's going to be a tough ride. Tough old ride. I don't know who's going to win the game, to be fair with you guys. Don't know who's going to actually win there. Who's going to be have broken legs after this game? There, it's got it's basically like Dublin team versus a Dublin team. Really? Yes. Honestly, Mayo have literally basically got fitter, quicker, faster. They have there, like Kilkenny, basically there. They're quicker, speed, everything there. It's like watching hurling. Really? Yes, it is. Absolutely, 100% it is. There, if if there's no such thing as Dublin um, in all Ireland's there, Mayo would be winning every single match like Dublin. That's my opinion. Really? Yep. But Dublin are in it versus Mayo. And that's going to be a tough, tough, tough Absolutely, 100% and 50%. Very tight game there. Everyone would be on their toes watching the game. Ah, no one of those fucking easy games. As they're like, oh, yeah, we... Actually, you know what, guys? What? We'll let uh, Mead win this game, right? For the first half. Then second half, then we'll put our boots on, okay? And we get the healthy drill out there and we drill it through them. There with the, with the hand pass on the solo one. And we do the parse to parcel as well. Okay, guys, that's our... That's our, sh our shift today. Let's go. And then what happens then? They do it. Really? Yep. But when it comes to Mayo, 
different story altogether. Right, guys, before we step on this pitch, right, we drill it through them there, right? This is the last final game now, all earned final there, and then you can relax there, get broken bones, and get Plaster Paris on you there with VHI clinic, and you'll be fine, okay? So let's go out there and win this fucking all earned there, because for we are very lucky that we actually are playing in the all earned. Why? Because of fucking COVID. Because China made some nice good old bat soup there. But created a good old COVID after it. So, this is our chance now to win another All-Ireland there. With a stupid, crappy 2020 year. And at least we put a good old name on it. Dublin win the All-Ireland in 2020 with COVID. That's very true. And then what happens then? Hopefully, please God, cross my fingers. Yeah, I'm trying to do it now with this stupid thing. Cross my fingers. I hope they actually dubs win it there by either two points to three points is all we need. Or as people always say to us, and even Fast and Furious. I'm a Fast and Furious fan up with Paul Walker and all. Yeah. And Vinny, Vin Diesel always says this and this thing. Doesn't matter if you win by an inch or a mile. Winning's winning. Okay? So it doesn't matter if you win win the game by two points to twenty points or by a point. Winning's winning. That's all I'm gonna say. So Mayo versus Dublin is gonna be a very tight game. Dublin know exactly how Mayo are going to react. They play the they play them in finals, they play them in quarterfinals there before. And they know exactly what they're going to do. And they all know the tricks in the book as well for Dublin. But not all the tricks. There. They'll do nice little sneaky ones. Because Cluxton. You may look at Cluxton there. You People might say he's a fucking idiot. Right? But when it comes to Cluxton there. He might actually kick it out from the goals all the way to the other goal. Really? Oh God, yeah. Are you crazy? It's worth losing his um, second toe in the game. Really? Oh, God, yeah. It's like, who, who who's going to win the million euro? That's what it is. There, Cluxton will kick out small little kick outs there right in front of him, like me and the camera. Little kick there, and then Keane goes for it there. He hand passes it off to Mossy Quinn. Shane Wright takes the ball, and over the bar it goes. Like that. Quick moves. Instead of the owl... Okay, guys, ready? I'm going to kick it now, right? And it's going to go to this guy over there in centre, number nine. Here it goes. Ready, niner, minor. Here I go. Ooh. Over the bar it goes. There, cut the ball. Solo went down the line. Here it goes there. No one cares about your social life. Over the bar it goes. Oh. Over the bar it goes. There, like that. Quick and simple, Dublin are going to do it. Ready? They're not going to be doing those fancy shit there with me either until like that. They're going to take a quick and simple passes there. Take your points and the goals will fucking come. Or even just take your points and, and win the fucking game. You know what I mean? But with the O'Shea style, will be very tight, like I said in this video. Very tight. So thanks, guys. I'll see you next video.